There is a select number of people in this family that drink coffee. It's me and Kristen are currently the only two people in this house that drink coffee. When husband gets here, he will drink coffee too. But neither of my in-laws drink coffee. So we have this little percolator, which I've never even seen before until I came into this family. And I need both hands to put it together, apparently. But this is how I'm getting my coffee this week. Good morning, my friends. Welcome to Tuesday, December 21st from not so sunny, but still beautifully warm Florida. I'm super stoked to be out of the polar vortex. I'm sorry yesterday's vlog was kind of nothing, but I warned you, it was a travel day, I warned you. So I'm currently making coffee. I just woke up, I don't even know what time it is. It's probably like 8.45. Um, so you know how I talk about when my husband's home, I end up staying up late and sleeping in later. It's a family trait because we were all up, I think we went to bed. My father-in-law went to bed at like 11, which isn't so bad, but he's the one that has to get up and do surgery the next morning. So that's when he went to bed and then we were up a little bit later. I think I went to bed by 12, 30, one o'clock. And that's pretty standard here. So we'll see, we'll see how this day goes, but it's currently 8.45. I am making coffee in the percolator. And today's plan I think involves shopping because Ingebrets and women like to shop. So, and I think Kristen has some Christmas shopping to finish. I could be wrong, but I don't know. And I like shopping, so why not go with? We will see what the day brings. I'm going to edit my video. It's going to take me, just as a warning, the next couple days, the videos, well, because that's all that's left of Vlogmas, by the way, crazy. Um, will be up probably a little bit later because the internet is really not cooperative here. And it took me over two hours to upload the video yesterday after my internet crapped out on me. And so I got here and as soon as I walked in the door at like 9 p.m. I started uploading the video. Right before I went to bed I noticed there were comments on it. So yeah, that's how long it took, a couple of hours. So I'm going to drink some coffee and get on that video editing thing and I think I'm gonna go sit in the other room by the big Christmas tree because it just I walked out of the bedroom this morning and it smelled so good oh um, what else what else oh I didn't tell you guys I'm sorry my arm hurts and I don't know what to do about it I haven't found a good vlogging perch here yet um, I weighed in I don't know what's going on but I weighed in the yesterday yesterday I think now I can't remember I'm gonna go look. It was yesterday. I just looked at my little scale app and I was down like four pounds. Four pounds. And I haven't been perfectly behaving. I mean, I've been, I, I've been eating kind of what I want within reason, but less of it. Like I, once I get full, I stop and I don't know. I don't know what's happening, but the weigh in yesterday was good, which is both a great and bad thing because one of my goals was to not lose control here, but I'm going to enjoy myself here. So maybe this kind of whatever's happening will even out. I don't know. I don't know. But it was, I got on the scale and I was like, say what? Are, are you serious? And, but it was, and I, I kept trying to tell myself that the scale was lying to me, but the scales don't lie. It literally, measures your weight you can't cheat so there's that but i'm gonna get editing because i don't know what the day's gonna bring but i'm gonna do my best to bring you along let me back up a little bit so has anybody ever taken the time to look at the back of a chipotle bag and realize that it's in pig latin pig pay atlay <laughs> kristen just read the entire back I'm not of done the yet. bag where are you where? Okay. Wait. Are you still reading? <laughs> That's my favorite. <laughs> so many questions. So little time. <laughs> then again, if you are s sitting, sitting, it's sitting, sitting there with a bag full of burritos. Maybe you have the time to ponder Underpay. <laughs> and decode all this. And if 
that is the case, then it's back, then sit back, unwrap, and ponder away. Away way. <laughs> ponder away way. Oh my gosh, that is so funny. Good job, Kristen. That was a struggle. I didn't uh, read the does top. your brain hurt now? It does. I didn't read the top. Since Ethic. then, the since the first, I'm assuming that's Chipotle. Chipotle, Chipotle che, che. Yeah. Opened in 1993. We have learned learned a Otley. a lot a lot oh. <laughs> <laughs> a lot about pigs. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, breakfast is still four points because my mother-in-law went to Sam's Club and bought me my breakfast sandwiches. Happy, happy day to me. Welcome to the backyard. This is better than any hotel, man. A pool. There's a hot tub. There's a tree growing out of the boat. Look at that. I'll have to show you it at night because my father-in-law put Christmas tree lights on it and it's hysterical. It's amazing here. Amazing. And palm trees, because it's Florida. Oh yeah, towel. she was taking pictures. Paper towel? What's cooking, Kristen? Venison. From a deer that I shot. <laughs> oh, this is, yes. This is my deer. This is your deer. This is my little doe. Oh. Here you go. Thanks. But yeah, venison. First time making deer from my own deer. That's really exciting. I know. I didn't know it was your deer. Hopefully she'll be tasty. I hope so. I'm going like this. I'm going Here's just trash. It's on photo. I'm not <laughs> And we've got, what we're making is zoodles. It's super, super help, healthy. We have venison and onions and spaghetti sauce. With zoodles. Are you? This is what's happening. <laughs> she, are you videoing me? Yes. Videoing? Yes. Oh my. All we need is grandfather. Vlog. Video camera. <laughs> Vlogception, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Oh my lordy. Oh my lordy. And we've got zoodles. Lots of zoodles. We have two plates of zoodles. Hi. For just the three of us. Because we like zoodles. Because we like zoodles. And we've got Texas toast because why not? This yeah, is going to be reasonably healthy and I'm super excited about it. Yum, yum, yum. Here it is. Zoodles and a super meaty sauce. A little cheesy Texas toast. Mm-mm. Good. And healthy. Good evening, friends. It is, I think, just about midnight. What time is it? Oh, it's after midnight. It's technically tomorrow, but that's okay. I'm going to hop on here and sign off anyway. Let's see, what kind of things did we do today? I spent most of the day shopping with Kristen, and I forgot my video camera. So I wasn't able to vlog most of it, so I apologize for that. But we did some shopping all over the place, local mall. Um, where else did we go? Maybe we went mostly to the mall and to Ulta. And I introduced her to a more than one step skincare regimen as, you know, my duty as a sister-in-law and as a beauty blogger. So that was fun, kind of exploring new products for her to try to make things a little bit more complicated, but not too complicated that she won't do it, you know what I'm saying? So that was fun, and we came home and we had an amazing dinner, like you saw. It was really delicious, and except for the Texas toast, which was way delicious, by the way, uh, it was really super duper Weight Watchers friendly, which was awesome. So I haven't even been misbehaving all that much. And then I had um, some macaroons for dessert because the little macaroon store that was at the mall and I was so excited about and then closed last time I was down here is now open again, which is very exciting. So I got myself a little six box of macaroons and ate two of them. They were very tasty. And yeah, we watched Hairspray Live. And have any of you watched Hairspray Live? Did any of you watch it? I want to know your opinions on the casting, personally speaking. And I want to—I I like to think I have some sort of license to gripe and moan about this, being a music theater major and all. But Ariana Grande did not belong in that show at all. Zero. Zero percent. Epic failure on casting. And truth be told, 
There was a lot of the casting that I wasn't too thrilled with. The people that I loved were Derek Huff as Corny Collins, uh, Jennifer Hudson as Motormouth Mabel. Oh my goodness, she she dominated. She was by far the shining star in that show. And Kristen Chenoweth, because I love Kristen Chenoweth and she can do no wrong. But other than that, I wasn't terribly impressed with the casting. Link left me meh. The special breakout star, Tracy Turnblad, left me meh. And I was incredible. Oh, don't get me started on Penny and Ariana Grande. No good. No go. And no one else was just really all that impressive. I don't know. Did you guys watch it? Let me know and tell me your opinions in the comments below. I would love to hear what you guys thought of it. And that's all I've really got. I'm going to go to bed tomorrow. We've got another fun day of family. Fun and exciting, but really laid back and not so exciting things. Um, I know Kristen and I are going to get pedicures tomorrow, which is awesome. And I heard from Hubby. He's working hard, like always, which is great. And he'll be down here on Thursday. I'm super excited to see him. And that's about it. So I will talk to you guys all tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Mwah.